In honor of Memorial Day, News Channel 34's Jamie DeLine tells us that the New York State Senate has passed five bills to improve the lives of veterans who are still with us. Memorial Day is to honor those who have fallen, and the best that we can do to honor their memory is to pass bills in the, in, at the state level, at the federal level, at every level of government to make sure that we are honoring the living. Recently, a package of veterans legislation passed in the state Senate. Included is a bill sponsored by Senator Jessica Scarcella Spanton that would inform local veterans organizations when a veteran is returning home. It's the most difficult point of transition for a returning service member is that first couple of months to that first year. She says local veterans organizations can help make the transition to civilian life easier. When my husband returned home, um, you know, we didn't necessarily know every resource available, whether that's housing resources, mental health resources, um, using the post 9-11 GI Bill, which he ended up doing, which is a great resource. So there's so many different things and so many different elements that we have here in New York State. Uh, and this will help those resources, those veterans be connected to those resources. Senate Minority Leader Rob Orr explains another piece of legislation that recently passed in the Senate as well. There was a, a bill in here, I think, that um, uh, dealt with uh, naturalization, with, with, with people who serve in the military, uh, having a, 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 a pathway to become citizens, which I think stands in stark contrast to some of the things we're seeing around the country today. So I think those those bills uh, were, uh, to my knowledge, were all supported by our conference. This bill would also allow a pathway to citizenship for their family members as well. Reporting in Albany, I'm Jamie DeLine.